Okay, today we're going to just raw upload this. So let's, um, and see if the door barrier thing is the same or if it's absolutely different. Let's see, what else do I need? Another thumbnail, let's do something like that. I wonder if it opens... I might have to switch windows, actually. Because <laughs> I wonder if it launches in the play space or if it launches in the work window. Oh, looks like it'll just open in the work window. That's convenient. Oh, maybe not. I just get white. Switch over to the play space, maybe? That's hilarious. Okay, so we've got, so that works. I'm just gonna hold forward. Oh shit. Oh. See, that was pretty smooth. Got it. Hmm, I wonder what that first little hiccup was, but it looks like, maybe it's the door. Maybe I'm getting caught on the mailbox. Yeah, looks like um, looks like it kind of solved itself. There's a little tiny hitch right here. Other than that, it looks um, looks pretty good. All right, let's jump back into the work window, and um, I'll put a temporary facade. Then I can get to uploading it to various different places, like officially upload it to VR Chat, and then. There's a few other places that I want to upload it, so I can hang out in said places. Okay, so how does one put a facade down? Because if I just put in a plane like this is a strategy, but there's wall here, <laughs> so... Right? Because if I rotate the door out, see there's wall. Can I subdivide this thing? It comes kind of subdivided. Okay. So can I delete vertices? Nope, I can delete the entire thing. <laughs> well, I can do it the dumb way because I don't know a better way yet, which is to lift everything up here. Okay, does it work? Sure. Is it pretty? Hell no. But um hey if it if it works, right? Maybe. So let's go back in here and see what that looks like from the other side. Okay, well, I mean that's a wall. Can I still see the oh I can still walk around it sort of. Haha, -ha, cheating! And I can walk through it from that side, but I can't walk through it through this side, so that's okay. And the door. Okay. Uh, the other thing that I can do as well is I can extend the sides to make it more of a box and hide the invisible apartment. Is there a box? Oh, you can't see. Is there a box select for this function? If I go merp. Actually, what I should do is take that side. So what I should actually do is this. And then go ha ha. Like this is grab, this is move, this is rotate, and this is scale. 
Is there a box select option? <laughs> okay. Move it back. Ah. Move it all the way back. Yeah. And then let's test that out. Yeah, because even if we have some floor here, which I could probably get rid of that also. Okay, so it's a little more dangerous because I put the spawn a little close to the edge, but it's not that far. There's a little weirdness and lighting going on here, but that's because it's been, you know, the sides here are just stretched over. But um, unless you fall off, everything seems to be fine. So going in. Oh, I need to change this. There's not supposed to be a little white thing here. That's mostly because I, whoa. Mostly because I extended that out. Okay, everything seems to be looking okay. Can you see the walls from in here? Nope. Ah, uh, back face culling. Great. Uh oh, how do I close this? Oh no. I can open these, but I can't close them? Uh oh, I have to look at that. Oh wow, the hitbox is like way over there? How does that work? So that door is just stuck then, huh? Hmm. I'm gonna have to look into that. Okay. Cool, so we fixed... Technically fixed... Well, technically one problem solved itself, and then we added another element to the thing, and I found... Um, something else that I need to fix, which is the closet closing animation. Cool. So, I don't know. Progress.